bodies are in the picture. And that is the only way of our minds communicating with them. The reality is there's a substrate that has allowed this phenomenal complexity to exist, that things like DNA itself is complex, but it's a closed book. The real complexity of life is not in the DNA. The real complexity of life is the reading of the DNA, of which, of course, the DNA is self-structured self to uh, develop a system that can read it. The reading of the DNA, the complexity of life, is overwhelming. The question is, from where does it arise? How did light beams manage to do all these things, let alone to wonder about them? Because that's what's happening. We're condensed light beams. It sounds corny. We're condensed uh, or, or poetic that we are con they're made of stardust, but we are. Five billion years ago, everything you see around you, including what you see in the mirror when you brush your teeth in the morning, was stardust. And it just happened to become alive. And that stardust was made of the, the initial elements of the universe, the hydrogen, the helium, a few other elements. And those elements were made of quarks, and those quarks were made of the light of creation. The light of creation shines in everyone. You just have to let it shine forth.